Well, all day today, this memorial right here behind me in front of Chicho's has been growing all day with people leaving flowers, candles and balloons after last week's deadly shooting that killed two people. Now tonight, Granby Street is very busy. Many people in and out of restaurants and bars on this street, and there is a heavier police presence than normal tonight. Many officers are patrolling up and down Granby Street and nearby streets in downtown Norfolk. A heavy police presence on Granby Street. Yeah, there was a big police presence here last night. We could definitely tell the difference. The general manager of Baxter Sports Bar believes the extra police patrolling in downtown Norfolk will help. It's definitely going to help downtown Norfolk. Right. And the, the, you know, keeping eyes on ears and stuff to the ground and whatnot. Mm -hmm. So, and if you can see it firsthand, I mean, that helps a ton as well. There's been talk among city council members to close bars in downtown at midnight to curb violence but nothing permanent just yet. The general manager at Baxter's has mixed feelings about it. There's part of it that I like because just I mean, lifestyle wise, it just helps a ton. Cause like, well, we were doing that during coronavirus. We had to close at midnight, you know, but it definitely does affect the bottom line. Cause we're busiest at night. With the heavy police presence on Granby, I caught up with the father visiting the area with his daughter. Um, as we're driving up, police presence was, was high. Uh, I feel safer than ever coming out here. The father says this is their first time on Granby since the deadly shooting. I do feel very safe having a bunch of police people around. Chief Boone says there will be an increase in police patrolling Thursday, Friday and Saturday nights until further notice. Yeah, it's definitely a good thing for the businesses. People feel a little safer. It's good to see them out there and it's good that he's doing, you know, everything he can do within his power and we'll see how long it lasts. Police tell News 3 they have no possible suspect information at this time. Police also tell us they will be out here patrolling until 3 a.m. in the morning. Live in Norfolk, Leandra Head, News 3.